Hi, welcome back to Once Upon a Game. I'm Kevin Kitchens, and in this episode, I'm going to do an unboxing of the Fields of Fire Mission Pack, or uh, Mission Pack expansion. This is the 9th Infantry Manchu's Bulge Campaign for December 13th, 1944 to January 8th, 1945. So this uh, obviously is a um, Ardan expansion. Um, uh, comes with a you know terrain deck uh, that you're going to use to play that mission. So see what you get inside. So obviously this comes in a uh, Ziploc bag. You want to add this to the contents of Fields of Fire. Unfortunately, Fields of Fire doesn't have a lot of room in the box, but there is a newer version coming out, I believe a reprint that has everything in it, or at least a bigger box. So uh, keep your eye out for that. But until then, you can just keep it in the baggie. So. Uh, anyway, uh, it's going to come with a deck of, uh, you know, your standard terrain cards for Fields of Fire. This is, uh, you know, no forest on this one. I'm not going to open these because, uh, you've seen Fields of Fire. If you're looking at this, you know what's, what the terrain cards look like. So these are just the special terrain cards for the Arden Forest. Then you got the missions for it right here. And it is a, the nice GMT matte finish, uh, rule book, fortunately. Um, this comes in at 36 pages and contains all the information for the missions for this battle. Let's see, there are, looks like seven missions included. And then it's got your uh, information for your units, the ammos, the steps they have. Uh, more details about each mission will be in this. The order of battle, uh, both sides take prisoners. But you know all the these are special rules for this these scenarios. So, and there's mission one. Just got to set up the uh, the terrain. Mission two, purple heart corner, and so on. So that is the mission book for this. And then we've got the historical situation, which is a historical booklet. Mission booklet, oh, excuse me, the contents is historical booklet, mission booklet, sheet of counters. So this one gives you the background of uh, the battle and all these uh, these missions that you're fighting, the Heartbreak Crossroads, the battle for Lawsdale, Purple Dark Corner, Elson Board Ridge, etc. So it's kind of a learn your history here of what you're about to play and how it, how it actually fared. How the order of battles originally structured and then here's a log that you can uh, photocopy or you can download this and you can print this out and uh, track who is what what you're assigning the smokes to be etc and then we've got new sheet of counters here so you've got some new german forces that you're going to go against, fire teams, uh, fourth, fourth Panzer Group, and then some additional uh, American forces. More machine gun ammo, rocket ammo, spending fire missions, pillbox terrain modifiers. You get your airborne counters. Because it was in a bag, these one got a little bit bent. You can see the sheet itself got a little bent, but you know, the counters themselves seem fine. And so they are, they are the kind you got to cut out and, and then you'll want to pre-round them or you want to, they're not pre-rounded. So you want to round them with a Oregon Laminations 2.5 millimeter deluxe corner rounder, the correct tool for the job. And then we've got a couple of reference cards here. The Volks Grenadier squads, the Panzer Grenadier squads, let me their types and their steps and their last two steps. And then a reference charts for vehicles or weapons, their range, their defensive value, whether they're mobile, so on and so forth, chart for that. And then finally, we've got a, another copy of the company log, again, that you can just photocopy or laminate and use dry erase. So here's the World War II US Army Parachute Infantry Company log, and this is the World War II US Army Company log. All right. 
and then you get the deck of cards. So if you pick up a copy of this Bulge uh, expansion for uh, Fields of Fire, you're going to get the deck of cards that we saw. You're going to get the reference cards. You get one sheet of counters, a historical situation designer notes book, and the mission book with seven missions to fight through in Fields of Fire Volume 1. This is an expansion for Volume 1, not for Volume 2. So that is everything you get in the game from GMT Games, designed by Ben Hall. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you. Bye-bye. Oh!